Good morning, everybody. It's actually morning. It is, I'd call this super morning. It is not even five in the morning yet. How many times can I say morning in the beginning of a video? I don't know, but I'm morning that I have to stop. Haha! -ha. I'm waiting for my taxi right now. We are going to the airport. I'm going to Amsterdam. What? Let's go. So I've now made it to the airport. If you haven't noticed, I don't have any hand luggage. Actually, this is one of the first times I've traveled in a very long time where I just have a bag on my back. We'll see how I do. I stuffed this thing with like pairs of clothes and things for the trip. Hope I didn't forget anything. <laughs> the American breakfast at this Garfunkel's restaurant um, offers a pancake. They're not gonna move on that, no budging, just one pancake. Great, here's my underwhelming American breakfast at the cold pancake. Thank you, England. I'm gonna try some HP brown sauce for the first time. Which is gross. <laughs> Why? I'm alright. It's weird. It's definitely weird. It's definitely woke me up quite a bit. I'm feeling good. Ready for Amsterdam. Ready for gate 49. Let's go. I managed to sleep the entire flight. That's what a neat concept to have it. Oh, I was just like this. <laughs> oh, great nap. It was a great nap. I honestly, as soon as I went to sleep, I, I just heard them go, we're landing, and I was like, what? I love how school kids in Amsterdam don't have to take the bus. They just, uh, they all have little bikes. That's, that's really fun. Our hotel looks like a prison, because it used to be a prison for kids. Like, <laughs> what is this? All right, some prison stuff. Cool. Oh, there our prison jacket. What is this room? What the? Wow, look at your fun bathtub, mate. Look at this. This is um quite interesting. Oh, look at that couch. What the? Wow. I mean, I love this green, man. I definitely support that the entire room is Shrek green. A uh, very nice Shrek color here. So every room is different. And this one has the funnest bathroom ever. Here's the sink. There goes the wall. <laughs> there it goes. It's literally the entire wall just moved, and now there's a shower. What the heck is this? That is that is my shower. Okay, cool. It's in a giant mirror. Great. I can look at myself. Walk. Hey. Oh wow, this is a nice. We've now boarded the tram, and we're going off to the Richkov <laughs> Museum. A museum that is really pretty, but I've never actually been in. Very excited. I'm going to the museum. Oh, but that's not today. That's today. Oh, Great I can't wait to go there so I can be loving Vincent in theaters. Look at him go. Made it to the Richikibadabadabam Museum. There's a live band playing The Lion Sleeps Tonight right now over there. We're at the Amsterdam sign. It's a bit drizzly, but it's lovely. It feels like autumn right now. I always wonder why people want to stand next to the word Turd, like what are you doing? Got a uh, Dutch delicacy here, uh, not quite, but it's a it's a chunky dog. Okay, it's, it's a hot dog with bacon and cheese. It looks good. I'm happy. I'm just really hungry. Like obviously he's just been stabbed. You don't have to poke it. Mm. Like what are you doing? <laughs> well, just just stick your finger in my wound. Thanks. She won't stop looking at me. Oh, that's scary. Hey, uh, <laughs> big fan of giant angry swan. This is the sexiest library I've seen. We finished up at the Rachs Museum, and uh, hello, you've just said hi to me. What do we got in this package? Most beautiful or worst drawing ever made. Beautiful. Oh man, it's me and the love of my life. Thank you. I can't believe it. I got this for reals now. Thank you. This is, uh, they should put this in the museum. It, it belongs next to Rembrandt. Look at this one. Whoa. Look at that detail. Yeah. So we've now made it to the Van Gogh Museum, which is exciting. Turns out you're not allowed to shoot any videos or pictures. And I forgot my Snapchat sunglasses. So basically I'm gonna have to see what I can do. I might get one shot, get kicked out. You know, I definitely don't want to end up in Grope Central Hall. I mean, what, wow. Well, the Van Gogh Museum was really cool. Wish I could have filmed some of it, not allowed. So whatever I got, I got, you know what I'm saying? But it was really fun. Uh, like literally just going through the history of Van Gogh and seeing all the different types of art he was able to make. Sadly, didn't get to see Starry Night as made famous by my shirt, obviously, not the one I'm wearing now. You know, this one, the, the, the me shirt. Uh, that one's in the MoMA in New York, so. This is the restaurant we'll be eating in tonight, the Restaurant de Cass, and no one's in there yet, but it looks really, really pretty. They grow their own tomatoes. This like smells like home to me. We grew tomatoes at my house a lot. 
Well, after waking up so early this morning, I'm completely dead. Tomorrow we're going to Noonan, where Van Gogh grew up. Let's just fast forward to then. I really need to get more sleep. I stayed up all night learning German. That wasn't very smart, but it's an hour and a half drive all the way to where Van Gogh was born, so I have some time to sleep in the car, but let's get some breakfast. I decided to get something for breakfast I've never seen before. A giant chocolate croissant. This doesn't look like a chocolate croissant camera. Oh, that's weird. All it tastes is chocolate. We've made it to Noonan. There, there's where Van Gogh lived, right there. That's where everyone in his family was loving Vincent. So here we have this art piece. This, what? Were any of you born in the year 2000? Because then you'd be quite young. But if you were born in Noonan in the year 2000, you'd get your little name and a birthday around this tree. Literally, just loads of little Little birth names and ears, like Roll, on the 28th of June, and oh my god, Demi Lovato, holy crap. Question, how are you supposed to actually pronounce his name, though? Van Gogh? Vincent van Gogh. Gogh. Here's a statue of the potato eaters, eating their potatoes. We're at the Vin Center right now, where we're learning a lot about Van Gogh, uh, with these fun laser things and headsets, and they have weird... Harry Potter-like portraits that are just constantly moving. Do you guys feel like this is like Harry Potter? Constantly. It's like Harry Potter. It is like Harry Potter, yeah. It's really creepy. They're like slightly, like this guy right here, he's, he was just talking to us a little earlier. Cunt, you ook. So all that extra Van Gogh art was at the Kuhlenmüller. I'm not really pronouncing that correctly. Kuhlenmüller. Kuhlenmüller. Well, that was a one-sided snap, but we fast-forwarded now to the future. It's my last day in Amsterdam, and it is pouring rain outside. We're supposed to do a walking tour. So today's breakfast is super Dutch. We got Dutch pancake and some partridges. Yeah. This building is literally leaning towards us. That is, that is creepy. I wish there was a little festival for the rest of all. Wow, you can just buy magic mushrooms. Okay. So after exploring a bit of the red light district and seeing some of the sides of uh, Amsterdam I'm not really supposed to film, we're now going to head to the airport to head home. This is the best airport ever. Free kisses. The airport has uh, cush ceilings there. Just, wow, that's, um, that's funny. We've gotten through security at the airport and we head up to McDonald's and in Amsterdam slash Holland, McDonald's has frit sauce, which I'm really hoping is fry sauce, obviously, um, which is ketchup and makes it mayo. My Utah friends know what's up. Let's see what's in here. Interesting. That is not ketchup mixed with mayo. I think that's more of a Belgian style fry sauce. So I think I just had the ideal airport experience. I got to the border. There was no queue. I just walked straight up and went, here's your passport. Ah, oh, you live here? Yes, done. In and out. One minute. This is the best. I am now back in my room, and wow, this marble looks so much better than the other bedding did. I like coming back to my bed at the end. It's like a nice finishing move. Boom, finished, Amsterdam. Hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't know, what was Evan doing in Amsterdam? There's a lot of subtly little hashtaggies. Love and Vincent, it's a film that's coming out soon. Uh, I got to see a little at a premiere, and it was great. It's freaking, it's like literally an art museum, except you don't have to go outside, just go to the movie theater. Anyway. I'm going to be seeing you guys, like, next week. I'm going to Australia, so I'll see you then. <laughs> Goodbye!